Hey, what's up, everybody? Now, hopefully, you'll be having a great time. It's your boy, Yashvia Cracking. And if you're new to my channel, guys, I would like you to kill my and smash the subscribe button right about now, okay? And also, ring that bell notification, guys, because when I drop a brand new video, you will get notified, okay? So, today, I'm going to show you how you can easily uh, get your Twitter API key, okay, for your website, okay, for your uh, applications, okay? So, if you're creating Android apps, if you're uh, about to integrate Twitter API key, okay, so if you want your uh, website members to uh, log in uh, on your website using the Twitter accounts, so this tour is for you guys. So as you can see, I would like to enable social login here. And um, here it says how to get Twitter's key, okay, and uh, here it's gonna enable the network and it's gonna ask you for an application key and the application secret key okay so you have to enter both of that so today i'm going to show you how you can easily get your uh twitter api key okay so you have to visit this link developer.twitter.org.com uh, sorry developer.twitter.com and here is a uh, developers page okay so once you've inside here, so all you got is to uh, sign in into your Twitter account. And here, before you click on apps, so you're going to uh, click on apply. Okay. So you have to apply. As you can see here, apply for access. Apply for a developer account. And here, this is the latest 2020 uh, front end. Okay. So you will see... Uh, page like this and it's gonna it's gonna ask you for your primary reasons for using the Twitter developer tools okay so here um, we are gonna choose uh, explore exploring the API okay and you're gonna hit next here if you have um, if you would like to switch your username if you would like to create a new username you can do that and you can set your email address and also it will ask you for the country that you uh, where you live okay and then after you have filled this in okay so I'm just gonna enter my real country and my real name I hit next and here guys in the, here it will ask you how will you use a Twitter API or Twitter data for your website for your apps okay so in your own words okay and mainly in English You'll have to describe how are you gonna plan to use the Twitter data and the Twitter API. Okay, the more details, the response. Okay, so you'll have to uh, give a response at least with uh, 200 characters. Okay, 200 words here. Okay, and you have to be specific, and you have to uh, you have to describe thoroughly okay you have to describe thoroughly how are you gonna uh how are you gonna use a twitter data including any analysis of tweets okay and if you have uh, government entities also you have to be thoughtful and you have to describe okay so let's begin guys um okay so I'm gonna leave all of this in the uh, in the video description down below. So all you gotta do is to copy this, copy and paste it here. Okay, as you can see, it, it changes into a gr green tick. Okay, and here just copy the second second one. Okay, yes, I'm planning to perform explore exploratory data analysis. For example, our content shall deliver to uh, Twitter accounts so just paste at least uh, paste it here moving on and here just copy this yes our app will be used to tweet our site content on Twitter account from our website by a post composer tool okay copy paste okay and here just do a th Repeat, yes, I may end up displaying data about Twitter contents uh, that shall be displayed. Okay, so that, sh 
uh, that will be displayed online on our seat by a plugin. Copy, paste, and here is the last part. Will your product or service uh, use a data analysis to make Twitter content derive information available to a government entity? Okay, so just like this, yes, our product service or analysis may take may make Twitter contents or derive information available to government entity. Copy, paste. Okay, so if you don't use this, if you turn this off, guys, okay, so if you don't uh, want to use a government entity, okay, so just uncheck that, hit next, and here uh, it's gonna it's gonna ask you is everything correct okay is primary use uh, the primary usage so I'm applying for exploring the API and it's a personal account okay and here I'm integrating our posts and providing tweets or Twitter information to government entities nope looks good and please review and accept so if you would like to read the developer agreements okay go ahead but just keep that to be honest uh, if you want to check it out okay just check it out okay and just click on submit application and here guys boom uh, it says you did it Thank you for applying for our access on Twitter developer account. And here it will say to please confirm your email. Once confirmed, we can process uh, and review your application. And uh, here, as you can see now, all you have to do is to click your Gmail account and just log in. Alright, so in, inside your Gmail account, guys, you should receive a verification about this. Oops. Okay, so just click that Twitter developer, okay, and just confirm your email. As you can see, it should be confirming right about now. And as you can see, application under review. Application is under review. Thanks. We have received your request for API access. I am now in process of reviewing it. Okay. So all you have to do is to keep an eye on your email. Okay. Guys, so you have to monitor your email. Um, within a few minutes or within a, uh, like 30 to 40 minutes, it, it, um, it can depend. It can be one day. Okay. So as you can see, we've, we've just got it. And developer account and case under let's see application hi we have received hello as you can see hello we have received your application for twitter develop develop account and we are starting a uh our review please keep an eye on this email address and your spam folder in case we reach out for more information and uh we know this application process might delay getting started with the Twitter APIs, but we must use uh, information to offer the best, the best support to our developers while protecting our platform and serving the health of the public conversation. Okay. So what does this mean, guys? It means that you have to monitor your email. Okay. So just monitor your Gmail, and uh, sometimes it may be in. Uh, you might receive it. it maybe in the spam okay in the spam folder you will receive it okay and uh, yeah so this is gonna take at least one or two hours and it might be delayed okay in some cases guys it can be it can take 24 hours or 48 hours for them to uh the twitter support team the twitter developers the moderator on twitters they will review your application and then uh, once they accept it okay so you will receive another uh you will receive another email and yeah so on my next video guys once my application ac gets accepted i'm gonna do another video about that okay so for now guys i'm gonna end this video right about now so if you really like this video so far guys please leave a like and uh, turn on that bell notification 
and also if you have any comments okay you can leave your comments down below okay so guys so if your application gets accepted so this is a last part all you gotta do is to uh log in to the developer account and all you gotta do is to click on create apps so it will ask you the following this so you'll have to enter this this app will provide information about user profiles tech related such as android application mobile information social media website tools and latest diy okay diy do it yourself tips and tricks okay so just enter latest diy tips and below this uh there will be another box uh, another content where you have to put this this app will use uh, to tweet our online website content on Twitter account using our composer post tool which is a plugin for WordPress okay so or you can use uh, which is uh, which will be a composer post tool for github okay which is a plugin for WordPress and uh, you are currently developing the plugins on github okay so you can provide the, uh, the source code the ul of the source code on the github address and uh, if you don't have a privacy policy for your page guys so this is my website private police privacy policy and um, as you can see so i'm gonna i'm gonna post this here all right so here is the website privacy policy it's very simple okay so you can use a generator to quickly or you can just copy mine okay just copy mine and um, paste it make it uh, a better private policy page okay and uh, yeah guys so uh, thanks for watching okay so i will and don't worry guys uh if you haven't got this part okay if you haven't got this part about uh where to insert this where to insert this and where to insert uh, this privacy policy link okay so i'm gonna do another video when my application gets accepted okay so um for now guys peace and i'll see you guys in the next one okay in the next tour in a few hours